NVIDIA strives to push the boundaries of what is possible with 3D graphics. To make that possible, we are committed to enabling developers to leverage graphics APIs like Vulkan to their maximum potential, and that's where NVIDIA developer tools provide an unparalleled experience. With Vulkan 1.3, you now have access to nearly two dozen new extensions. Some extensions like VKKHR Dynamic Rendering help you to simplify your code while improving readability. Other extensions such as VKKHR Shader Integer DAW Product or VKX Pipeline Creation Cache Control provide new functionality to help you build even better graphics applications. No matter what extension you're excited about, Insight Graphics and Insight Systems supports all of them, ensuring that you have a tool on day one that helps you solve real-world problems quickly and easily. Insight Graphics is a professional-grade tool for graphics developers that allows you to debug and profile advanced Vulkan and Vulkan ray tracing applications. With features like the Ray Tracing Acceleration Structure Viewer, the Shader Profiler, the upcoming Ray Tracing Shader Timing Heat Map, and the incredibly powerful GPU Trace Profiler, you can get full visibility into the internals of NVIDIA GPUs. This gives you the power to harness the GPU to its maximum potential and lets you focus on achieving incredible RTX graphics that wow gamers like never before. Insight Systems is an application performance analysis tool designed to track GPU workloads to their CPU origins within a system-wide view. Its features help you analyze GPU utilization, frame stutter, graphics, and compute APIs, assisting you to deliver complex, immersive, high frame rate games with impressive RTX graphics that delight gamers. We're excited to say that all of these features are available for Vulkan 1.3 today, and we can't wait to see the amazing things you'll create using NVIDIA GPUs. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to send us your bugs, feature requests, and general feedback using the integrated feedback button at the top right of the window. If you like this video and would like to see more like this in the future, be sure to leave a comment and subscribe to the NVIDIA Developer Channel.